Cody. Hey, I'm going out to a job today, Sunday. I'm just gonna go program some remotes. I'll try to talk the lady into doing service on her door. But you know, one remote is gonna be 260. Two remotes will be 381. But I'm gonna try to do a deal with her to service her door. Probably hasn't serviced it. So all you people, when I tell you that most people, if you just ask them if they service their door, they're almost admitting to no, they haven't. Then that's kind of an easy sell after that. And you can give them a break or whatever. Then you end up getting 500 bucks basically for a remote control. So anyway, I'm heading out there. I'll see you when I get to the job. We'll see what happens on this one. How to get set up in this business. I got my phone right here. I got my tool in the back. I don't know if you can see them. I got a little junction box down here with my chargers in it. Got my coffee here. And this is all you need. This is your office. Your little mobile office. People call you. You answer your phone. You go do another one. And this is it. Right here. Hello. Your eyes door. Hi. Do you want to open it? No. Yeah, just, just okay, thanks. Alright. I changed this bottom panel. They still haven't painted it. Hey, you still haven't painted it, huh? No, the guy that's <laughs> supposed to paint it has just like been doing other stuff. Yeah. I know, terrible. You need to paint it, I can paint it for you. Really? Yeah, I, I mean, would, it's not a big deal. It's... I would pay you to paint it for yeah. sure. Yeah, that would be great, because yeah. it's annoying. Do you have you have any of this paint by chance? I might, but I don't honestly I mean, I, I don't really need a lot of it. I just need to computer match it. I know. I... <sighs> I've got paint cans over here, but, and I'd be fine with like painting the whole door. Yeah, you might, you might have to. Itself. Yeah, yeah, you might have to because of it being be, faded. Exactly. Yeah, and I'd be fine to do that. Yeah. Uh, do you think any of that I is? Have no idea. Well, you can see the color like here. That's the light blue. That kind of looks. Yeah, but you see, I just need a, 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 the color. Right. Even if it's faded. Yeah, I just need even that right there. They might be able to use. Okay. And that's been out, so yeah, that's probably faded too. Yeah, and if you just too. do that, the whole door. Or do you want me to bring this thing with me? Sure. And then, uh, let's see here, I'll put that in there. And then you needed a remote, right? Correct. Did you ever get a battery for the, for the second one? Let me see if I got those exact ones. If not, I have a universal. Yeah, the same one. Anyway, yeah. here, so let's do it. They're, they're, they're not like the old ones where you can just slide them open. Okay. They're kind of sealed pretty tight. I guess they do that for water. And then I just wonder on the keypad, do I need a, I mean, will that run out of the battery? Does that happen at the same time? Or it... The keypad? Yeah. Does that work now? No, it works fine. But I just wonder if I should. Well, if you do, you, you see, this is easy to change. You just push that down and then there's the battery. Okay, perfect. And then you just put, you put you. that back in there like that. Good teaching, thank you. And that works. And that, that still works. You just yeah, press enter, right? Fine. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That battery lasts forever. Okay, I finished that job. I painted the bottom panel there. I don't know if I took it before, but there's the bottom panel painted. It's still light out, if you look. It took me about an hour and a half to go get the paint. And you paint the bottom panel. And this is what I got, $931. And I got my hands a little painted there, but everything's done. I'm on my way home. You know, a lot of you guys are on the fence. You're calling us and it seems like you're you're procrastinating whether you should do this or not. It's it's the best business, I'm telling you. You get unexpected money all the time compared to other trades or other jobs or anything you got to do. It's really rewarding to get paid for what you know rather than what you do. So most of you guys out there are getting paid for how much time you're there and you're getting paid for more of how long how hard you work and you know it's always a hard job you have to do just to make a little bit of money and it takes you know days to get paid or whatever this is like the only trade where you can go in and out really fast and make great money and you're not even tired anyway my advice to you guys is learn this trade I promise you when you start getting calls it's so addictive you're just gonna want to keep doing them you're gonna figure out how to get more calls we can tell you that too and your phone will ring off the hook and you'll start going out and doing repairs we got a lot of people saying oh i'm going on my first job and a lot of people calling and saying i can't believe i just got made this much money and all that stuff and it was so easy and those guys are doing it and it doesn't take that long it's not that hard to do do it in your spare time you can pause it and do it some later pause it and then eventually you get your certification 
you'll understand how to work with the cables and springs and all that stuff and you can always refer back to it because it's a lifetime access to the course even after you pass so you can actually go back if you're on a job and you forget how to reset cables you forget how to wind springs whatever you can go right to resetting cables watch a little five minute video and then refresh your memory and go back in if you ever get stuck but even if that you could call us text us do whatever you guys want to do we get guys all the time asking certain questions normally about springs because they can't a lot of the older springs you can't tell which spring it is i always tell them what to use anyway it's good to know this business it's a little bit tricky business but once you know it i'm telling you you're like a, a wanted man out there people are going to be hunting you down to fix their doors and they're going to be happy to pay you they, they pay it because they don't know how to do it they don't want it. they just want it to work and they don't know who to call to do it and you're the one they call so Anyway, 